Danny must be really pleased with the workout this afternoon at Millwall. Yeah, I think it was a, a good day for us. Um, a real step in the right direction. Um, good attitude and work ethic from the from the group. Uh, for me, it's always you know always looking for mindset, and I thought the mindset was really good today. Yeah, and it, and it seemed to be really positive both without the ball and and with the ball as well. Yeah, I think so. You know, you play, it's a big challenge for us. You play against a really really good Millwall team in blazing hot conditions, and I thought we were really aggressive against the ball, and that flowed into our play with the ball. Um, and yeah, I thought we, we we carried a really good threat all afternoon. And do you have to adapt? to the heat or do you just think, well, no, it might be boiling hot on August the 10th? Well, uh, we just said that to the group. We don't know what the weather will be come, come August the 10th. And we, we normally know that in this country there's one or two really hot Saturdays in the first part of the season. So you have to be prepared and ready. And um, yeah, I thought as a group, we looked in a, in a good physical condition. And, uh, two or three players like Ben Goodliffe and uh, Lyle Taylor, who missed early early games, have come into the squad for the last couple now. Pleased with their progress? Yeah, yeah, some, some good minutes for the whole group, really. Um, I thought Lyle and Brad looked a real threat up there. I mean, Bradley's had a, had a really good pre-season to, today. He looked such a threat in behind. Um, I thought we pressed as well with a real aggression and intensity. Lyle led that for us, um, and and yeah, uh, I, I thought it was a, it was a, it was a, it was, a, it was a really good afternoon. And pleasing to see Sampson on the on the field of play for a yeah, game as well. Yeah, yeah, good to get Sampson back. We've been holding him back. He's one that you need to hold back. He's been desperate to play. Um, and he come on and, and wow, him and Awara when they come on was such a handful up there. Um, and yeah, I thought we looked a, looked, a, looked an athletic, powerful team. And uh, for us, yeah, step in the right direction, not to get not to get ahead of ourselves. Pleased, pleased also with a clean sheet because um, we haven't had enough since I've been in the building. My teams, I've always been used to keeping conceding less than a goal a game and keeping lots of clean sheets along the way. And this is a uh, this is this is certainly a good way to win games. So that, that was a, a, a real positive as well. And do you feel you're in in a good place 11 days before the start of the season? I think we're working progress. I think we've had lots and lots of change. Probably we anticipated change, but probably not this much. Um, so it's a new group, and at the moment we're just you know today we looked at the idea with with, with two forwards. Um, and yeah, for us, it's to it's it's to try to bring the relationships and the partnerships and grow them both on the pitch and off the pitch, and also look at look at the different ideas that we have available to us because we know that in a in a 46 game league season plus plus cup cup competitions, you play against lots of different teams that pose lots and lots of different different f challenges and threats. So so for us to um, yeah, just to keep looking at the, 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 the different ideas that we have within the group. But today was good, I thought. Yeah, when, when I compare it to the Wickham game and the, the, the Peterborough game, I thought it was, a, it was a step up for us in terms of, um, I suppose, the opponent, the challenge, um, but also the quality of our play.